on. I'm uh, sorry if this isn't going to be a very um, pleasant video, but see, there's something that's been going on on YouTube that I think needs to be addressed. Now, this is in regards to a YouTuber by the name of Behind the Meme. No, this video isn't addressing my problems with the channel because I do have my own problems with the guy. Here's the problem though. Behind the Meme began his channel surprisingly not long after I did. I, don't, I think. I can't remember. Well, I don't know if it's anywhere here, but like, yeah. The thing is, though, um, so anyway, when Behind the Meme started his channel, he basically just began it with simple meme videos. Now, his channel is founded on the premise of, okay, let's see this. Oh, we create new videos weekly, aiming for three a week. Three a week. He has not uploaded in a month. Alright, and let's see, when did the Penguin join him? He joined on August 12th, 2016. And I... Joined. Okay, so he started a few days before I did, but that's not the point. The point is, about a year or so after he started his uh, channel, so a few months ago, I think it was, a YouTuber, two YouTubers by the name of Pyrocynical and Emperor Eleven made videos video each lambasting the guy criticizing him for his content what these people should have known is what would happen here's the thing online when you do a response video the person you're responding to is guaranteed to get um crap thrown at them you know Let's just scroll this a little. Now look, guys. I understand you don't like his content. But at the end of the day, I want you guys to all remember something. To all you people who have been spamming the hateful comments on Behind the Meme's channel. I'd like to remind you all, behind that computer screen... There is a ordinary man, just like you, making videos. And he actually does put effort. I've tried. Well, not really. But I've done stuff similar to what he's done. I've done videos that need editing. Heck, I think this video probably needs editing. But, that is a person. You are sending death threats. Telling him to kill himself over a f***ing meme video. Do you not realize that? And here's the thing. You guys need a new insult too. Normie? What does normie even mean anymore? At this point, it's just another worthless comedy to throw at someone. And the worst part is that when he's, he hasn't uploaded in a month. And, well, actually, not that. That's not exactly the worst part. Let's go back to it. Here's the problem, though. Why are you telling him to kill himself over essentially memes, guys? 
And also, yes, there are legit criticisms. Hell, I have my problems. Here's the thing, though. His last video was on the Warriors Plan meme, at least at the time of this video. It has 3.5k likes to 12 goddamn dislikes. I bet at least probably 11 out of 11,000 out of those people probably don't even know what the hell's going on. Heck, usually bigger channels always have like 200 to 1,000 dislikes on them. You know, anti-fan retards and all that. But, now, this is actually one of his better videos. Now, let me explain my own problems with his videos. As of late, he has sort of done a bad job of explaining things. He recently, in a video, failed to show an accurate example of a meme's beginnings. And he has kind of stagnated a little. Which is a criticism someone actually threw at me. It's really disgusting. Way they feed me. Like, here you have a comment from someone who literally calls himself shit. I'm not even joking. This person calls himself shit. Now, that's an accurate statement because that's exactly what your comment is, good sir. Thumbs down to you because you're a turd. He says simply, don't come back. I listen to your shit. If you're watching this video, what the fuck is wrong with you? Don't come back. No, really, I'm saying all this off the top of my head, so it's completely unscripted. Yes, I do talk. Let me explain something to you, though. Just because he makes content you don't like, it doesn't mean he doesn't deserve his place on the internet. Granted, if you're doing a Logan Paul and filming dead bodies and electrocuting animals, then hell yeah, please leave the internet as soon as possible. And here's another thing from an idiot named Stormtrooper. The entire concept of your channel is flawed and an instant meme killer. The joke isn't funny though when you explain it. Now please, even though in the past I defend your channel, jump off a bridge. Wow, telling him to kill himself. But is an entire page on Encyclopedia Dramatics on how to kill yourself? I suggest you read it. And maybe you could learn something. Okay, now that I got that out of my system. Jokes can be funny when you explain them. Technically speaking, explaining a joke does not instantly kill it. Hell, explaining a joke can actually make it funny for you. Because if you don't get it the first time, Heck, I've been told jokes in the past that at first I didn't get them. When they were explained, I burst out laughing because then I was like, oh my god. <laughs> but still, and also, I highly doubt you defended his channel in the past because you just told him to jump off a bridge. You do know this is a person you're talking to, right? Oh, and another F A G G O T. Dude, Raging Death says, I think we won. I think you're at hole. And then you get another F for him, Jacob Wood saying, Why are you still making videos? Stop ruining memes. Excuse me? I still use Dat Boy. And guess what? He made a video on Dat Boy. Then you get another person saying, Please stay active. Really? I think, and then this other fag says, I think he left YouTube no videos for three glorious weeks. So let me explain something to you. Just because you don't like his content, you want him to get off the internet. Let me explain something to you, you little shit.
You know who you are. I've gotten tons of hate, especially from retards like you in the past because I defended him. Defended behind the meme, that is. And you can't, do you really, no. Just because you don't like someone does not mean you can drive them off the internet. I know I've said this a billion times, but I gotta try to point right the fuck home because clearly you retards are getting it. You see, in the earlier days of my channel, I, like many, had, had gotten hate comments. Of course, I pulled a Lily Pete and deleted them. Actually, you know, that's inaccurate. And plus, he or she wants to be called the Lily Orchard now, but we're not getting into that. I deleted comments. I am not leaving out things that are just de destructive criticism on my channel. And guess what? I had another little retard just like you come onto my channel and tell me, quit YouTube, your vids are shit. No matter the quality of someone's videos, like, hell, I have poorly animated stuff. And yes, I know, I have poorly animated, my own poorly animated TV show. Well, not TV show. Here's the thing though. I know this is a simple little argument that not a lot of people like using, but simply put, if you don't like it, you don't watch it. I mean, it's not like I'm re-uploading people's content. It's not like I'm doing anything harmful like Logan Paul. And by far, the biggest f on the internet is... D. Chessius. And it's not simply put, nice. He's dead. Now, D. Chessius, if you're watching this, and I hope I not stuck your name because you don't deserve to get your name correctly spoken. Again, I reiterate that as a person, you are saying that you are happy is dead. And why do you wish he was dead? Um, he makes videos that kill memes. Now let me explain it to all of you little spurgs out there who think spamming behind the memes content with channel with hate is going to do you any good. Let me explain something. Behind the meme doesn't kill memes. The only thing about his videos that kills memes is that whenever he uploads videos, you retards decide to say, Oh, well, it's dead. No. That's not how memes work. In fact, in a sense, he's doing what memes are meant to be. Memes are not little inside jokes. They are meant to be spread around the internet. Like the oh, really meme. You know, that cute little meme with the owl. Seriously, look it up. It's freaking adorable. Actually, I'll put a link in the description to it. Um, but still. Like it. I lost my train of thought there. I'm ADHD, so... And plus, if I am autistic, so what? I'm probably not, though. Just ADHD. Scroll! <laughs> the reason why these memes die, though, is because you guys decided that it is dead. Because when behind the meme up upload the video, you say, oh no, it's dead now, and then you go telling, calling everyone who uses the meme a f***ing normie. And the reason I'm not swearing is because I don't want to be immature like you guys. Right, I know. I swear a lot on my channel. Probably more than I should. And, by the way, Telling, calling everyone a normie for using a meme that Behind the Meme did a video on. You're the ones. That's right, guys. You memers, you're the ones killing the memes.
fact, I think you guys will be the real normies here. Partially for your lack of understanding how a goddamn meme is supposed to work. They're not supposed to be a simple little inside joke. They are meant to be spread all over the internet. Spread them memes. Spread them farther and wider than your mother. <laughs> Don't kill me, rejoice. Uh, yeah, I just watched the past, like, five minutes, but good luck. And also this, um, for Charlie Comment. Okay, dude, all your videos have, oh, well, it's 10,000 dislikes. You should just stop. No, you should not just stop because you retard. I've got a guy's channel. You should not be glad that you guys got a guy's channel shut down, essentially. You guys got a guy's channel shut down because you don't like his videos. And then there's a person calling himself Random Idiot, which is pretty funny, and he actually kind of makes a good point. BTM, pick a meme, make a video about it, get hated, get hated. Just look at the Drew meme. Drew meme, and you'll know what I mean. It's been a month, guys. I hope you realize this fan base is five year olds. So I've given up. I'm part of this fan base. Do I look like a five year old to you? And if you say yes, you're getting banned from the channel. You know why? Because I'm not going to listen to your little shitty ass argument about how I'm some little spurred in the internet. Oh, you don't want to chase it because, because I defend a guy who just wants to make videos explaining memes. Do you guys not realize just how much you are overblowing this? So I do like the comments, some guy named Dr. Game Pro 619 Oh, you little. And he says, or maybe, just maybe, he's living life. Unlike you, he has to make money to earn a living. While you sit on your console making, playing games all day while your parents feed you. Oh. Oh, wow. This guy actually got some cops people on his channel. The channel itself is a meme now. Oh, and you, sir, don't deserve to share the name of Doge. You know, that dog meme. I think we did. Someone either killed him or he gave up. Killed him. Now, I want you to know something. A while back, he made a meme about something, right? I think it was Leon Cat. And you fucks doxed him. You do realize you could get someone killed doing that. What if some psychotic fuck decides to murder him? What if someone did that to you because they didn't like your content? And don't say, oh, he kills memes. No, he doesn't. You guys do. Alright. You know what? I'm done. And also, I do want to...
address this one comment that's actually pretty good by a guy named Super Suck. Now, Suck itself is actually mean that it's spelled S-U-C-C. -C. Anyway, he says, I still don't get why people are reacting to meme killed. Like, I know a meme will die sometime and a new one will appear. That's how memes work. Honestly, it's sad. <sighs> you know what? I, I can't even deal with your bullshit anymore, guys. I'm just gonna stop the video right here. And if you're watching this, guys, I want you to know, stop bothering him, and stop telling him to kill himself over memes!